da damals ein, äh, es äh, ist eher das äh, Zusammenwirken aller Organe. Also in diesem und äh, es werden laufend Blutuntersuchungen durchgeführt, um eben eine äh, Funktionssituation zu uns bekommen, ohne Herzanfall. Und äh, wenn Sie keine weiteren Fragen haben, dann danke ich Ihnen. The president uh, uh, experienced uh, a cardiac arrest uh, this morning while he was at home. He was uh, uh, reanimated or he received cardiopulmonary resuscitation, which uh, was successful, and he was then flown into the hospital uh, where he was admitted at the emergency room and stabilized in terms of his uh, cardiopulmonary situation. His uh, heart uh, beat is back to n back to normal, so uh, and his uh, pulmonary uh, function uh, needs to be supported. The president uh, is on artificial ventilation at this point in time, and uh, remains in the intensive care unit for uh, the next hours and probably days. Uh, as in any uh, patient who collapsed and who uh, experienced a severe cardiac condition, uh, the president still is in critical condition. He is stable, uh, so his condition can be classified as critical but stable at this point in time. Uh, we cannot uh, forecast uh, uh, if the crucial organ systems in the body uh, were damaged by his cardiac arrest. Uh, that needs to be shown by the further course uh, of his treatment. Um, and for the course in the intensive care unit. Ich habe heute eine Koalitionsregierung von ÖVP und FPÖ angelobt. Heftige innen- und außenpolitische Diskussion. Auf Ihren Vorschlag genannt worden sind, wünsche ich für Ihre verantwortungsvolle Arbeit im Interesse der Republik Österreich. I would tell them that uh, Austria is a democracy. Uh, Austria uh, is respecting human rights. And uh, if you come